Welcome back to US Triple Tap. This is a out of the box review of the Springfield Armory XDM service pistol and with a 4.5 inch barrel which is the standard for the service in the XDM line and uh, let's take a look at what's in the box. Here we go. XDM as usual has the, the rail system on both sides of the box. Let's open it up and take a look what's inside. Okay, you got the single shot uh, piece of brass that comes with the gun. And inside here, what do we got? We have we have a paddle holster that comes with the gun, and that way you can slide it on to your pants easily, and you can slide a belt through it if you want to thread a belt through it. It's adjustable. Tension. You have three back straps. That's what's great about the XDM line is you got a small, medium, and large back strap. One size fits all hands. You don't have to buy a different gun for different size people. Uh, you have a loader for the magazines. Makes it easier to load for people that um, don't do it old school wise. Okay, you have a double mag pouch here. All right, this one here has a belt loop or uh, a belt feeding loops in the back of it. Also has rails on both sides that you can put the easy reloader on or you can put a light for the gun on it. The gun itself comes with a rail so with this holster here you're not going to be able to put the light in this holster you're going to have to get an aftermarket holster. Uh, in that case if you do have a light for shooting at night you can put that on the either the um, double mag pouch and not that paddle holster. I thought the paddle holster had it, but not that one. Um, you got two magazines that come with the gun. They're 16 round magazines and um, for this 40 caliber XDM it has a four and a half inch barrel into service gun. All right, take the flag out. Inside you can get a good look at that match grade barrel. It's polished. That ramp is polished. Slide release, break down the gun just like a SIG in uh, right there. You got the extended on the XDM, you have extended um, magazine releases, ambidextrous from both sides there, so it makes it easier to do it. From this angle here, you have a real thin top there, so that way smaller hands can reach around and still get a, a good um, setup on the trigger. Uh, you knock a pin out there, slide a different size back strap, and you're good to go. Different size hands. Like the 1911, this has a grip safety, all right? This pin there says that it's cocked and ready to go. If I don't have my hand on that, I can press that trigger all day and it's not going to go bang, all right? If there is one round in the chamber, it will show that there, that's an indicator that will pop up when it is, uh, there's a round in the chamber, all right? Once again, with grip safety there, I now have a good grip. You have a Glock style trigger here. I'm going to show you the press. Here, it, um, XDM has the shortest reset trigger in the production gun advertised. This is the reset. All right. So that's about it on the gun downrange here. Um, three dot sight. Match grade barrel, light for the uh, rail for the light, ambidextrous magazine release, adjustable back straps on the XDM series, grip safety, whether or not it's uh, cocked or not indicator, and that's about it. This grip system is a little bit different on the XDMs. Got one on the front here. It's really a positive feel on on the grips on this. I really like these guns. All right, see you downrange. Okay, we're downrange to test fire the Springfield Armory XDM service pistol. It's got a four and a half inch match grade barrel and we're gonna be shooting it in 40 caliber. Let's take a look at it and see how it does. Stand by.
All right, we're shooting for center mass. This is uh, the first time shooting this gun. It's out of the box review. Uh, this, once again, is the four and a half inch barrel, full size grip, and that's our grouping. Uh, as you can see, this is the A zone, A scoring zone, and my grouping is just here, a little bit low, a little bit left. I actually have a tendency to shoot this type of a target a little bit low all the time anyway. Um, but not, not bad grouping for a 15 yard line. Uh, let's go ahead and take a look at how it does in a failure drill. Okay, as always on our um, reviews of weapons on US Triple Tap, we do a, uh, a failure drill at the end, which is what Triple Tap is named after. Uh, this was the Springfield Armory XDM 4.5 inch barrel service pistol and 40 caliber. Uh, let's take a look. You're gonna, have, you're gonna have to hit rewind because I have no idea where that double tap went. It went in the uh, center body mass somewhere, which would be there. I don't think it was a really great tight double tap. I think it was a little bit loose. So I got a feeling that one's mine right there in the double tap. As far as the head shot goes, where are we at? There we go. Shot to the head, knees dead again. So anyway, once again, thank you for visiting US Triple Tap. I look forward to seeing you downrange. Take care and have a good day.